Do I gotta say my name? No, nickname or just uh, to, just, just start. Becca. Becca, okay. Becca. Um, so what what Becca, what what do you feel that happened in your life? No matter when that that you feel that really impacted you and and kind of got you facing more and more struggles. Um, since I could ever remember, since I was this small, um, you know, I, I dealt with you know um, addiction in my family with my father, you know, and and uh, so that kind of led from the lottery. Okay, and so that kind of led to um, you know struggling, you know, with having to deal with you know an alcoholic father, you know, watching him beat my mom, you know, and, and you know my brothers going and, and pulling them off of him, pulling them off of her, you know, it, it, those are struggles. Those are struggles that you deal with every day. You know, and, and they stay with you even to as, as an adult, you know, it, it's just, you know, it's how you, I guess you go about the situation, <laughs> you know, um, I struggle every day here, you know, um, um, so I, I was out on the streets before, this is my second time around, so I was out on the streets since, uh, for about 10 years prior before this year, well, before th this, this time out, um, so then I got, I had my first kid, um, got sober for seven and a half years and then I unfortunately I went back out which caused me to have more struggles I had to come back to the street you know I, I couldn't stay with my mom anymore you know I had to let my son stay with my mom and um, not to bring him out here so I wouldn't have to struggle more you know and uh, so then you know I'm out here I've been out here for about a, probably another almost 10 years pro pretty much just about you know, um, going from trap houses to, you know, which are abandoned houses, you know, and, and there and then back to the street again, and then trap houses and then back to the street again, you know, back and forth, you know, so it, it, every, and it's a struggle every day, mm. every day, you know, I'm in this program called Inside Safe, you know, and, and it's a struggle here, mm. you know, it, it's not knowing um, how, how they are going to, the people that work here are going to wake up that morning that is gonna set our day for that day, you know, is a struggle. You know, I, I stay in my room, I, I don't go out. Um, every here, you know, once in a while I go out here and there, you know, to go do what I need to go do and then come right back. But other than that, you don't see me out of my room, you know, and, you know, we, we can't um, go into people's rooms because, you know, of whatnot, you know? And, and you know, there's struggles every day here, you know? You got people overdosing, you know, you got people, you know, unfortunately, you know, uh, uh, my friend, you know, I've known him for 20, 21 years, you know, he overdosed and um, I was one of the people that was trying to help and uh, he wasn't revivable, you know, and, and it's sad, you know, that people have to go through this alone when they shouldn't have to be alone. Mm -hmm. thank, thank you for sharing your story, Rebecca.